Hello, welcome to this Landsweeper vulnerability video. Recently, two new vulnerabilities have been disclosed regarding Exchange. Uh, they have not been disclosed by Microsoft, but rather by the Zero Day Initiative. Both of these vulnerabilities are currently unpatched. There's no way to really fix it without taking some mitigation steps. So it's important that you take a look at the blog post that we have, make sure you apply the mit possible mitigation steps so that you're at least secured until Microsoft releases official fixes for the exchange vulnerabilities. Now, both vulnerabilities can lead to, if exposed or if abused, they can lead to a remote code execution. So it's important that you apply those mitigation steps as soon as possible. Now, in order to find your Exchange installations, obviously you can use Landsweeper to get an overview of your entire IT environment, and that includes also Exchange servers that you have on premise. Now, in here we have a, an example of one of our uh, reports that we've created for specifically Exchange servers. Um, so it will give you an overview of all of the Exchange servers in your environment. Currently in our demo environment, we just have one, but it gives you additional details already in the report, like the IP address um, and also the name of the system, as well as operating system details and Exchange details as well. Now, similar to any other asset within Landsweeper, if you click on it, you can get additional details um, we can get much more details about the exchange property specifically, if you need that. Um, but in general, it's just for you to know where are my exchange servers located, um, so you can more easily find them and start applying the mitigation rules. Now, if you want to grab this report, all you need to do is head over to the Landsweeper website, where in the report library and also linked in the blog post that we have that also covers the mitigation steps, you can find the report, uh, a link to the report, that um, will let you simply copy the code for the report. You can grab the report, import it into your installation, and you can get the overview of the Exchange servers that you have in your environment as well. So all you need to do is grab the report, run it in your environment, you'll get the list, and then you can get started on the mitigation. If you don't have Landsweeper yet, you can always try out Landsweeper for free. Um, you'll get your, uh, your unlimited trial, and you can also grab the same report and also get the list that you need to start working. So that'll be all. Thank you for watching.